The Minister of State for the Environment, Sharon Ikezo, says President Buhari has approved the establishment of 10 new national parks across Nigeria. This comes on the heels of rising concerns over illegal bushmeat consumption and wildlife trade. Esther Mokpariola has deep reports. And Available reports show that Nigeria has emerged the top transit point in the world for illegal ivory and pangolin-scale trafficking out of Africa to Asia. Between 2016 and 2019, more than half of pangolin scales seized globally came from Nigeria. Following this grim picture, a non-profit organization, Wild Aid, launched a public awareness conservation campaign in Nigeria to reduce demand for illegal bushmeat in major urban centers and support enforcement activities to tackle the illegal wildlife trade. Speaking at the occasion, Minister of State for the Environment, Barrister Sharon Ikazo, says the federal government of Nigeria is committed to protecting, restoring and promoting sustainable biodiversity. Let people be aware that these species are all endangered and they're going extinct and also the causes of some of the infectious diseases we're having you can see we're going through Lassa fever now it's from animals rats we've had Ebola from animals to prevent zoonotic diseases to keep this animal in the wild health and environment are intrinsically linked if we have an unhealthy environment we will become unhealthy so it's for selfish reasons partly but it's also these incredible animals when you get the experience of seeing them it is something which is a, a incredibly moving experience there is an increased contact Lagos Commissioner for Health on his part says disrupting the delicate balances of nature with our heavy human footprint causes major repercussions such as severe weather changes and biological threats like COVID and Ebola. These markets, we are trying to discourage these markets where people go into the forests and just harvest animals without understanding that by taking these animals out of the wild, you are actually reducing their numbers. And when you reduce their numbers, then they gradually go onto the endangered list and they become extinct. Now this gentle creature you can see on my arm is a seven-month-old pangolin, but sadly very few of it is left in the wild because it's being poached for its skin, or scales rather, and meat. What more can you tell us about this? The rate at which it's been taken away from nature, it's alarming. If we do not come out en masse, to protect our heritage, these animals are going to disappear in our time. In the meantime, efforts are being made to promote village-raised hybrid chicken as an alternative to illegal bushmeat for suppliers and consumers in Nigeria and across Africa. Esther Mokbariola, TVC News, Lagos.